Shocking. Why can quantum radar make stealth fighters no longer stealthy? Why are stealth fighters no longer stealthy? Why is quantum radar so amazing? Hello everyone, I'm Old Lou. You might not know that the stealth art of stealth fighters doesn't make them vanish into thin air. Instead, it uses special aerodynamic designs and radar absorbent materials to ensure that the electromagnetic waves emitted by traditional radars are sent out but never returned. But quantum radar is like a master of dimensional reduction attacks, it employs revolutionary principles such as quantum entanglement and quantum superposition to instantly render stealth fighters invisibility cloaks useless. What's even more gratifying is that in this pinnacle showdown of global quantum radar technology, Chinese research teams have broken through numerous technological blockades, moving from the laboratory to practical application, becoming one of the few countries in the world to master core technologies. Today, I'll take you on a deep dive into this national treasure that is rewriting the rules of modern air combat and reveal the magic it hides. Ready? Let's step into the wonderful world of quantum radar with China. 1. How was the stealth fighter's emperor's new clothes seen through? In the 1991 Gulf War, the F-117 Nighthawk stealth fighter bomber, with its unique multifaceted design, tore through Iraq's air defense network, completing 1271 missions without a single loss. This was the world's first glimpse of the practical power of stealth technology. The core of this revolutionary technology lies in anti-radar detection. Taking the F-22 Raptor as an example, its diamond-shaped nose cone design reflects radar waves in non-return directions, and its S-shaped air intake cleverly conceals the engine blades, which are strong reflection sources. Furthermore, the fuselage surface, with its up to 15 layers of radar-absorbent coating, acts like an electromagnetic sponge, absorbing over 80% of incident electromagnetic waves. These designs give the F-22 a radar cross-section, RCS, equivalent to a mere bird, appearing as only a faint flickering dot on traditional radar screens. Its successor, the F-35 Lightning II, has taken stealth technology to new heights. As the world's first joint service stealth fighter, the F-35 incorporates an advanced composite fuselage and smart skin technology, and its internal weapons bays avoid strong reflection sources created by external weapon carriage. According to Aviation Week, the F-35's RCS is as low as 0.001, equivalent to the size of a ping-pong ball, making it difficult for traditional meter wave and X-band radars to stably track its presence from hundreds of kilometers away. In combat tests in the Syrian battlefield in 2018, the F-35 repeatedly penetrated the alert zones of Russian-deployed S-400 air defense systems without being effectively detected, fully demonstrating the stealth technology's capability to achieve a dimensional reduction attack on traditional air defense systems. In the ongoing game between traditional radar and stealth technology, stealth aircraft, by means of radar-absorbent materials and optimized shapes, once made radar echoes almost disappear. But the emergence of quantum radar has completely shattered the stealth myth of stealth aircraft. This revolutionary equipment is based on the principle of quantum entanglement, emitting entangled photons that are generated in pairs and whose states are interconnected. These pairs of photons are like telepathic twins. No matter how far apart they are, if one changes state, the other responds instantly. When quantum radar operates, one of the photons is emitted to detect the target, while the other remains at the radar's receiving end as a sentinel. Even if the target absorbs the incoming photon through advanced have glass coating or special shaping, the disturbance it causes to the photon's quantum state will instantly transmit to its twin photon remaining within the radar, through spooky action at a distance. This subtle change in quantum state, after being analyzed by a quantum computer, forms a unique quantum fingerprint on the radar screen, leaving stealth aircraft nowhere to hide. As early as 2016, the 14th Research Institute of China Electronics Technology Group Corporation CTC, was the first to break through technical bottlenecks, successfully developing a 100-kilometer-class quantum radar. In simulated combat tests, 
This radar demonstrated astonishing detection capabilities against a simulated stealth bomber coated with half glass radar absorbent material and featuring a flying wing design. It could not only accurately capture information such as the target's azimuth and speed but also distinguish between different types of stealth aircraft through quantum signal feature analysis. This technological breakthrough marks a shift in the balance between stealth and anti-stealth towards the anti-stealth domain, building a new technological great wall for modern air defense systems. Furthermore, quantum radar can, leveraging the Heisenberg uncertainty principle in quantum mechanics, capture faint signals generated by quantum fluctuations in stealth aircraft. In the anechoic chamber of the Hafei Laboratory, the Qinghuan terahertz quantum radar conducted a groundbreaking test. When a model simulating an F-35 fighter entered the detection range, the terahertz band quantum signals emitted by the radar, like Agile Photon Scouts, cleverly penetrated the radar absorbent coating of the aircraft's air intake, directly interacting with the microscopic quantum states of the engine turbine blades. By analyzing the quantum phase information carried in the echoes, the system successfully constructed a three-dimensional quantum characteristic map of the turbine blades, making even nanoscale material defects on the blade surface clearly visible. This detection capability is a revolutionary breakthrough. Traditional radars, facing the radar absorbent materials and special shape designs of stealth aircraft, are often like blindfolded people navigating a maze. Quantum radar, however, is equipped with a quantum-level X-ray vision, using the physical properties of the microscopic world to tear open stealth camouflage. Even more exciting is the 2024 innovation from the University of Science and Technology of China. Their research team developed a quantum LiDAR that set an astonishing record at the Qinghai Lake test site. It can accurately lock onto ultra-high-speed targets moving at up to 13 km per second from 16 km away. Equivalent to accurately detecting a coin flying over Hangzhou Bay from the Bund in Shanghai. Tested by authoritative institutions, its detection sensitivity reached seven times that of traditional radars, and its response speed increased by three orders of magnitude, leaving no trajectory change of high-speed stealth targets undetected. In contrast, while European and American countries have invested significant resources in quantum radar research and development, their progress has been significantly slower. Taking the United States as an example, since the Defense Advanced Research Projects Agency, DARPA, launched the Quantum Sensors Project in 2012, Institutions such as Raytheon and MIT Lincoln Laboratory have cumulatively invested over $1.5 billion, achieving phased results in theoretical fields such as quantum entangled state preparation and manipulation, with multiple papers published in top journals like Nature Photonics. However, at the engineering application level, constrained by bottlenecks such as insufficient stability of low-temperature superconducting materials and weak anti-interference capabilities of quantum signals, their quantum radar prototype publicly tested in 2023 could only achieve one-third of the detection range of comparable Chinese equipment, with a false alarm rate as high as 18%. The situation in Europe is equally grim. The Quantum Horizon 2027 program, jointly launched by 12 countries including the UK, France, Germany, and Italy, while integrating top research capabilities from institutions like CERN and the Cavendish Laboratory at Cambridge University, has encountered technological gaps in long-distance quantum state transmission. According to an interim evaluation report released by the European Commission in 2024, the project's key performance indicators achieved less than 40%, particularly regarding signal fidelity in complex electromagnetic environments, where no effective solution has yet been found. It is estimated that at least another five to eight years of dedicated effort are needed to achieve deployable military-grade quantum radar systems. This technological breakthrough is of significant importance, meaning that the stealth advantage stealth aircraft have long relied upon is no longer reliable in the face of quantum radar. In future battlefields, the era where stealth aircraft could operate with impunity using their stealth capabilities is gone forever.
This not only greatly safeguards China's national defense security but also forces other countries to re-evaluate the strategic value of stealth aircraft when developing them. China sees that technological progress is constantly reshaping the rules of the battlefield, and China has already gained the upper hand in this quantum technology race. 2. Electronic Warfare Experts Nightmare – Quantum Radar's Golden Bell Shield Stealth aircraft in modern air combat systems build a dual mode through low observability and advanced electronic countermeasures. Take the USEA 18G Growler electronic attack aircraft as an example. It's integrated in slash ALQ 218V2 tactical receiver and in slash ALQ 99 tactical electronic jamming pod can perform full band blocking interference on enemy radars from hundreds of kilometers away. In the 2009 Red Flag exercise, an EA-18G successfully paralyzed the radar system of the supposedly invincible F-22 stealth fighter through precise electromagnetic pulse suppression. This classic stealth-on-stealth -stealth battle marked electronic warfare capability as a core combat capability for stealth aircraft. However, in front of quantum radar, this electronic fog tactic encounters a technological bottleneck. Traditional radars rely on the strength of electromagnetic echoes to identify targets, making them highly susceptible to deceptive jamming signals. Quantum radar, based on the principle of quantum entanglement, uses the quantum state of photons to carry information, and the receiving end only needs to detect minute changes in the quantum state to lock onto the target. This means that interference signals released by the EA-18G are like throwing pebbles into a calm lake, but they cannot disturb the flow of underwater currents, quantum radar, by directly capturing quantum state disturbances generated by the interaction between the target and photons, can penetrate interference in complex electromagnetic environments and precisely locate the true position of stealth aircraft. China's breakthrough in quantum radar is of even greater practical value. The Haidan 3000 quantum radar system, deployed in the South China Sea, employs independently developed quantum key distribution and coherent detection technologies. Even under X-band broadband jamming released by the USEA-18G Growler electronic warfare aircraft, it can maintain a 92% stealth target identification rate. This system innovatively converts quantum state collapse errors into target positioning information and through a 1024-channel parallel quantum detector array, it can complete a 360 degrees airspace scan within 0.1 seconds. According to public papers, this radar's detection range for F-35 fighter jets is three times greater than that of traditional radars, and its anti-jamming capability surpasses current NATO electronic warfare standards by two generations, completely rewriting the technological landscape of modern air defense operations. This powerful anti-jamming capability stems from the spooky action at a distance characteristic of quantum entanglement. It's like two secret agents communicating using a secret code that only they understand, even if the enemy intercepts information from one agent, they cannot decipher the content conveyed by the other. A 2025 Quas Hub study showed that quantum radar combined with AI improved drone identification accuracy by 40% compared to traditional radar in complex urban environments. This further highlights the advantage of quantum radar in complex electromagnetic environments. In contrast, Western countries are facing unprecedented technological bottlenecks in the race to counter quantum radar's anti-jamming properties. The U.S., relying on DARPA's Next Generation Electronic Warfare NGW, program, has spent over $2 billion developing new jammers, attempting to suppress quantum radar through multiband composite jamming and intelligent waveform deception. However, in actual tests at the Alaska Electromagnetic Test Range in 2023, the megawatt-level electromagnetic pulses released by USEA-18G Growler electronic warfare aircraft had almost no effect on quantum radar prototypes equipped with single photon detectors, with target identification errors still controlled within 0.3 meters. Several European countries have pursued a different approach, forming a multinational research alliance based on the EU's Quantum Flagship Initiative. 
They have established a dedicated test platform at Delft University of Technology in the Netherlands, attempting to crack the quantum radar's encoding mechanism and reverse using quantum key distribution principles. However, after three years of intensive research, their developed adaptive jamming algorithms, even in simulated environments, are still unable to break through the phase randomness generated by quantum state superposition, leading to jamming signals consistently maintaining a phase difference of more than 0.7 pi with target echoes, making effective jamming difficult. This technological impasse reflects a fundamental conflict between classical electromagnetic countermeasure theory and quantum physical systems, forcing Western research teams to reevaluate the technological roadmap in the field of electronic warfare. This anti jamming capability of quantum radar makes the battlefield situation more favorable to the side equipped with quantum radar. In future warfare, the electronic warfare landscape will be completely rewritten. It will no longer be about gaining an advantage by traditionally jamming enemy radars, but about facing a new adversary like quantum radar, which is almost immune to interference. This is undoubtedly a huge challenge for countries that rely on electronic warfare advantages, and for China, it is another powerful trump card. The transition of quantum radar from the laboratory to the battlefield marks the entry of military technology into a completely new era. It will have a profound impact on the nature of future warfare, prompting nations to readjust their military strategies and equipment development directions. China's leading position in this field not only enhances China's defense capabilities but also provides solid technological support for maintaining world peace and security. China has reason to believe that in the future skies, quantum technology will become the dominant force, and China will continue to lead this technological race. Conclusion, well, that's all for today's sharing on how China's quantum radar is making US F-35 stealth fighters run naked. If you have any questions about this amazing technology, or if you'd like to learn more, feel free to leave a comment and interact below. Thanks for watching, and see you next time.